So this is the remnants of Bursco Priory, which sits just outside of, well, Bursco on the one hand and then Ormskirk on the other. An Augustinian priory and obviously fell in the dissolution of the monasteries under the reign of Henry VIII. Uh, the bell apparently sits in the church in Ormskirk, so a future video may provide some footage of that, which is of course interesting. Hello, here I am again. This time I want to talk to you about another subject matter case while I'm here at Bursco Priory, just outside of Ormskirk in its ruins. And the subject matter case I want to talk to you about is Boyce and Boyce, and the citation for that case is 1849 1 Simmons 476. So if you want to get it in the English reports, it's 60 English reports 959. Well, the subject matter of the case were tangible property, and it was houses in Southwold that the testator Richard Boyce had bequeathed in the first instance to his wife by will, but then after her death in trust to convey one of those houses in Southwold to Maria, his first daughter, and then Charlotte, his second daughter. But the problem was that the nature of the, the will was that it included a provision that Maria was to choose which of those houses in Southwold she wanted, and of course any residue houses, any that were left, could then be selected by Charlotte. But Maria died in the testator's lifetime, meaning that she could never make that choice. Therefore, in terms of certainty of subject matter, the house that Charlotte might be able to choose was uncertain because Maria's operative gift, the idea of her making a decision to then free up potential houses for Charlotte to choose, could never be made. So the Vice-Chancellor uh, held that the, the gift failed, but don't lament too heavily for Charlotte, of course, because a resulting trust for the testator's residuary estate kicked in, meaning that the value returned to that estate and therefore may have been capable for distribution to Charlotte. So that's Boyce and Boyce, a very interesting case on subject matter.